Hey guys, this is Civil Learning Online and I hope you all are doing well. And today in this video, I will be continuing our topic which was modified Euler's method with new example. So guys, if you haven't subscribed this channel yet, then do subscribe this channel and before beginning, do like the video. And without any further delay, let's get started. So guys, the question is find the value of y when x equals to 0 0.1 and y dash means dy by dx equals to x square plus y, y 0 equals to 1 by modified Euler's method and taking h equals to 0 0.05. And if we read out, uh, read the question, then what we came to know, we had, we are given that dy by dx equals to x square plus y and we have to calculate the value of y for x equals to 0 0.1 and here we have h equals to 0 0.05 it means the value of h is going to be 0 0.05 means uh, first we will find x1 then x1 will be equals to x0 plus h and from here we will get x0 and this is going to be our h and in second step for finding the value of y2 we will we will reach x equals to 0 0.1 let us see how the solution is done and first I would like to take you through the formula which we will be using in this method. So let us have a quick view of the formula uh, so that it will be helpful for those who are starting from the beginning also and for if you have uh, watched the previous video then it is more good uh, if not then it won't matter here in this video. So let us begin with the solution. So guys in modified Euler's method we will need the formula for the Euler's method also. So let us first uh, write down the formula for the Euler's method. Euler's method. You do not need to mention this formula while uh, solving this numerical based uh, while, while solving this numerical in exam. Uh, you simply need to uh, start from the solution and uh, I am just writing this to make you more clear about this method. Uh, so the formula for the Euler's method we have x1 equals to x0 plus h and y1 equals to y0 plus h f x0 comma y0 and similarly formula for the modified Euler's method is y i n equals to y i minus 1 plus h by 2 times f x i minus 1 comma y i minus 1 bracket close plus f x i comma y i n minus 1 and guys this is the formula for the modified Euler's method and let us see the application of this formula with uh, by solving this numerical so in exam uh, from where we need to solve is here let us first write down given what we are given in the question so we are given uh, dy dash equals to x square plus y means y dash equals to dy upon dx equals to x square plus y and guys y 0 equals to 1 y 0 equals to 1 and if we compare it as with y times y x naught equals to y naught then from here we will have x naught equals to 0 and y naught equals to 1 and also we have y equals to taking y equals to 0 0.05 means we are uh, we are already we have all the question has already mentioned uh, that we need to take h equals to 0 0.05 while starting the solution so let us take y no sorry h equals to 0 0.05 now after this write down a line here by Euler's method Euler's 
सो बाई यूलर्स मेथड वॉट वी हैव y जीरो टाइम्स वन इक्वल्स टू वाई नोट प्लस एच एफ एक्स नोट काम वाई नोट सो गाइज सिंपली राइट डाउन द वैल्यू हेयर वी हैव y नोट इक्वल्स टू वी हैव y नोट इक्वल्स टू वन सो वन प्लस एंड वैल्यू ऑफ एच इज जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फाइव f x नोट कामा y नोट एंड द वैल्यू ऑफ x नोट इज जीरो कामा y नोट इज वन सो नाउ इन इक्वेशन वी हैव y डैस इक्वल्स टू एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस वाई सो हेयर वाट वी नीड टू डू इज पुट x इक्वल्स टू जीरो हेयर एंड y इक्वल्स टू वन इन द एफ एट फोर ड्यू टू हेयर वी हैव एफ एफ जीरो कामा वन सो हेयर इफ वी पुट x इक्वल्स टू जीरो एंड वाई इक्वल्स टू वन देन द वैल्यू ऑफ एफ जीरो वन विल बी वन एंड वन इज मल्टीप्लाइड विथ जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फाइव एंड देन इट इज एडेड टू वन वी गेट वन पॉइंट जीरो फाइव एंड गाइज यू मे हैव अ क्वेश्चन दैट वाई आई राइट जीरो हेयर दिस इज जस्ट द नोटेशन बिकॉज इट विल लेट मी शो यू हेयर इफ वी राइट हेयर बाय मोडिफाइड यूलर्स मोडिफाइड यूलर्स मेथड Euler's formula or method, it is same formula. Uh, we we need to use this relation here. So we will have here uh, y one one because this y one zero represents our initial initial value from where our solution is beginning. So our solution begins from the Euler's method. and this is our the first position in modified euler's formula so it is denoted as 1 and guys so from uh, we here uh, here if i put y i equals to 1 then we will have here y note plus h by 2 bracket f x0 comma y0 plus f x1 comma y1 and here zero and minus 1 and we have n equals to 1 here uh, let me show you we have n equals to 1 here from this as per this relation so guys uh, let me repeat what i did here uh, what we need to start from an initial value and the initial value uh, we get from the modulus method so that initial value is represented as y and uh, initial value is represented as 0 and we have got we first we need to find y1 because we have already y not so y1 and uh, initial value is represented by 0 and uh, we have used the formula for the euler's method and uh, after the finding that value we need to uh, use the modified euler's formula and in, in modified euler's formula we have to use the first position and uh, uh so uh, it it is y1 and the first position is in modified euler's formula and we uh, we use this relation here and uh, now use the value we have y not equals to 1 here so 1 plus h upon 2 means 0.05 by 2 f x not comma y not means x not comma y not means 0 comma 1 0 comma 1 plus f x1 comma y1 0 x1 we have we have x1 equals to x0 plus h and 0 plus 0.05 so it is going to be 0.05 comma y10 and we have calculated the value of y10 so it is 1.05 now solve this using calculator and from here we will get the value 1.051 y Three. Let me show you how to calculate this using calculator. Here we have f zero comma one, and uh, we have uh, f x equals to x square plus y. So put x equals to zero and y equals to one here. So zero plus one will be equals to one. So it is going to be one plus zero point zero five by two times one plus. means f 0.05 comma 1.05 see here 
here we have x equals to 0 0.05 so x square means 0 0.05 square plus 1.05 1.0525 now add these with calculator we will get this value let's add it here plus 1 multiplied by 0 0.05 divided by 2 plus 1 we have 1.0513 so now let us calculate uh, y 2 y 2 1 so y 2 1 means this represents the position at second position value of y 1 value of y 1 at second position so formula is again going to be same y naught plus h by 2 f x naught comma y naught plus f x 1 comma y 1 and this time in the in this step what we we did we use the uh, previous value so in here we will be using this value so y1 1, 1 now put the value and calculate the answer of y12 we have y0 equals to 1 plus 0 0.05 by 2 f x0 comma y1 note means 0 comma 1 plus f 0 0.05 5 comma y11 means 1.0513 now solve this uh, similar to the step which i have shown in this step while uh, using the calculator so on doing so we will again get 1.0513 so guys it means uh, we do not need to find the value of y1 at third position because we have y11 and y12 value same uh, in the in the previous example i have shown that uh, the value of y1 y11 and y12 was different so we need to proceed uh, up to the value y13 we have to solve this up to the position when we until we get the similar value here we have got the value of y11 and y12 is similar it means we have the value of y1 it means we have the value of y1 equals to 1.0513 if you have watched my previous video then uh, you will easily understand what i am what what i am trying to tell you and uh, let us move toward the calculation of value of y2 so guys uh, what we got there in the previous step what we got uh, y1 1 equals to y 1 2 therefore we will have y 1 equals to 1.0513 at x equals to 0 0.05 now let's calculate let us calculate the value of y at x equals to 0 0.1 which we have we are asked here so uh, what we are going to have here we have x 1 equals to 0 0.0 5 so we will have x not equal x2 equals to x1 plus h means 0 0.05 plus 0 0.05 this is the value of x1 and this is the value of h so it is going to be 0 0.10 now we need to calculate the value of y2 so again y2 0 because we will again proceed uh, from the Euler's formula so we have Euler's formula y20 equals to y1 plus h f x1 comma y1 now put the value of uh, each and every term then we have y1 uh, and the value of y1 is 1.0513 1.0513 plus h is 0 0.05 f x1 comma y1 and we have x1 equals to 0 0.05 comma y1 y1 is 1.0513 now solve this and find the value of y1 y20 and here we will get y20 equals to 
now uh, use the modified Euler's formula to calculate the value of y21 so again we will here write here Euler's modified Euler's modified Euler's formula so we have modified as per the modified Euler's formula we have y21 equals to y1 plus h by 2 f x1 comma y1 plus f x2 comma y2 0 now put the value of each and every term we have y1 equals to 1.051 3 plus h means 0 0.05 by 2 f x1 comma y1 means uh, 0 0.05 comma 1.0513 plus f x2 comma y2 0 and the value of x2 uh, is 0 0.1 one comma y two zero and the value of y two zero is one point one zero three nine now solve this to get, get the value of y two one and we will get here one point one zero five five now let us calculate the value of y two two uh, in order to check the value or uh, actual value of y two so y two again y1 plus h by 2 f x1 comma y1 plus f x2 comma y2 1 simply copy this value copy this formula here just change this term now put the value here so we will have here 1.0 5 1 3 plus 0 0.05 by 2 f 0 0.05 comma 1.0513 plus f 0 0.1 comma 1.1055 now uh, find the final answer here then on solving this we will get 1.1055 so we need to write one more step here as y21 equals to y22 it means we have y2 equals to 1.1055 and this is going to be our final answer which is the value of y2 at x equals to at x equals to 1.0 this is what we are asked in this question and i hope you find this numerical very helpful and see you in the next video uh, of this topic based upon the again the initial hello problem and that is the bangakuta fourth order method and till then stay safe and bye